My name is Marian Kost. I'm Vice President and Channel Manager of TI's Connectivity Business Unit. At TI, we're developing a vast majority of different connectivity solutions for our customers. Around us in everyday's life, we have more and more connected devices around us. Connected devices are in our homes, in smart buildings, in our grid infrastructure, in medical uh, devices, in our appliances, even in our factories that we produce products in. So we are showing really to the world here many, many new innovations and technologies. Important of those technologies is that they are complying to open standards. Because open standards are allowing to bring those devices into many, many more applications and make them available for many more developers. So let me show you a couple of uh, new demonstrations and technologies that we are realizing here at TI. So first of all, here you can see a new device that we have just announced to the market called CC2755. This is a device that is supporting the latest Bluetooth 6 standard and it's actually the first device on the market that has hardware acceleration and AI integrated to realize channel sounding, which is a new, accurate and secure ranging technology. We're showcasing that by showcasing actually a smart access solution where you have a mobile device which talks the new Bluetooth 6 standard. And as you move away from your device, from your access solution, you can see on the top screen that actually your door is getting closed. And as you move closer to the device, your door immediately opens. So what we realize with the AI-based acceleration at a very low power in this device is extremely low latency and high security based on a new Bluetooth 6 standard. A second implementation that we are showing here, which is brand new, carrying a lot of our new devices, new Wi-Fi 6 devices, new BLE devices, new Zigbee devices, devices that are supporting threat, uh, matter over threat, matter over Wi-Fi, is actually a multi-protocol implementation. In today's world, it's important that all these smart devices can actually be interoperable, that they work across boundaries, across protocols, and really build an ecosystem of smart devices and connected devices around us. So we have implemented gateway solutions, including screen drivers um, and many of the end devices, which again can be working on multi-protocols. So in this demo here, we're showing the implementation of matter over Wi-Fi, matter over threat, as well as Wi-Fi 6, in the IoT world, which comes with higher level of security and more robustness in the network, as well as our new Sub 1 GHz solutions, which are running a 15.4 TI stack and allows customers to implement their proprietary protocol into the same ecosystem network. And now let's go over to the second demo section. TI's new CC2340 family of devices is the lowest power and the most affordable 2.4 gigahertz SOC family in the industry. We're showcasing here a variety of different smart trackers, which allow smart tracker trackers to run for many, many years, more than 10 years of a very small coin cell battery. That's realized by TI's proprietary process technology being used for this 2.4 gigahertz wireless MCU. It allows to comply with standards as well in these smart trackers that are evolving, such as Apple Find My Network, Google Find Me, but they can also carry proprietary um, protocols in the same device. So developers can use that technology and apply to any smart tracker or geofencing solution uh, that they want to build. Over here, we're illustrating a smart building scenario. On the top, you can see renewable energy, in this case, solar panels being connected with a new solution called wireless solar monitoring system. This solution is featuring TI's new family of uh, broad and scalable sub one gigahertz SOCs combined with a mesh tech network protocol technology where we're showcasing rapid shutdown of the network in case of emergency, faster network formation, which is critical in those very reliable industrial setups. Um, then inside the building, we can see new uh, Bluetooth mesh implementation, again featuring the most affordable 2.4 gigahertz SOC in the industry with the CC2340 family, leveraging Bluetooth mesh on top of the open source Sephir um, Arto system. Sephir and, and generally the open source is a key strategic investment for TI because open source allows the community to much faster adopt the solutions in any type of applications, specifically here showcasing in a smart building scenario. 
In order to bring connectivity to many, many more applications and to make it even easier for customers and any developer to use technology, TI is investing heavily in wireless modules. Modules that are pre-certified and can be used in any embedded system being highly, highly uh, space optimized as well. In the first row, you see our new sub one gigahertz fully integrated system in package. The first device on the market leveraging a high output power amplifier up to plus 20 dBm inside a QFM package, including all the matching, the crystal components, really making sub one gigahertz implementations much, much easier than ever before and can run a whole variety of different protocols, whether it's security protocols for the building automation space, like PowerG, long range protocols like MyIoT, Wisun for the grid infrastructure or wireless MBUS, as well as any proprietary implementation. Same on the 2.4 gigahertz side, as well as on the Wi-Fi 6 for IoT applications, TI brings to market a variety of different module solutions to really make it simpler for the whole community based on open source software um, to implement connectivity into any end equipment. Thank you very much for watching. Please visit the link below or go to mauser.com slash TI.